And we're back, you guys, to more Fable 3. So, Mercenary Casa. Yeah, there is um, like a side quest very close to where we need to go for the main quest. Uh, I don't think it's really that important, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna try and do uh, all the quests of the game, even if some of them seem kind of pointless. But I think this does affect somehow I'm a wandering trader. something, I guess. But the roots become infested with marauding renegades. They're bound to rob me and kill me, or kill me and rob me. I'm actually not bothered about the order. You look pretty tough, though. Could you escort me there? I'll be able to pay you something once I reach the safety of Brightwood. Yeah, I want to fix something here. Even new type of gauntlet available. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this one that we got last time. Uh, I guess I still don't have the uh, the dual wielding thing. Yeah, when I do get it, I'm gonna mix uh, the Ice Storm with Shock, and it's gonna make a hell of a spell. At least to me, it's like the best spell of the game, or the best combination. Because I did try all combinations of spells in my other file. Well, the one that... whatever. So we gotta hold hands, like... Like really weird, weird people just are. holding Let's hands. Go. There we go. Oh, look at they just, they look so cute together. <laughs> yeah, people in this game don't follow you. You have to hold hands in order for them to to follow you. You can try and skip some of the battles that are along along the way because there are gonna be some bandits attacking us on every turn but I think I just avoided one cuz yeah but you can't avoid all of them I think there's like a group waiting at the exit and uh, but it shouldn't be a big a big problem I guess And it's not, right now, you know, I'm not holding hands with him, but he keeps following me. Um, wait. I think he's stayed behind. Well, it's a good thing. Here are some enemies. Not sure if they can hurt him. Maybe, I guess. Never seen the guy die. How are you, dude? Oh, there he is. So as you can see, the spell throws a bunch of ice, uh, ice spikes down. But if you combine it with shock, it's like a rain of ice spikes that shocks people at the same time, paralyzes everybody. And it hits them, so... I to me, it's just the best combination of spells. The other ones don't have a uh, continuous effect. Most of them are just one shot and that's it. So let's take care of these guys. These should be the, the last little group that we have to face. Because we're barely right there at the exit. Oh, this guy's on the way and won't let me hit the other guy. <laughs> there we go. Come on, man. It's so weird to hold hands. An adult, an adult male can't get can't get anywhere without holding his hand. <laughs> I mean, I get it if it's like a uh, like a really delicate woman, but I don't know. Whatever. 
I mean, women can be tough too. That's why I have to specif uh, be specific and say a delicate woman who's not like not familiar with combat, who's afraid of bugs, you know. <laughs> so we bring this guy in, and that should end the quest. Okay, see you around. We've made it. Thank you. Here's a little something for you. Oh, and come back later if you like, when I've got my stall set up. I'll give you a good price. Alrighty. So I guess we'll, we'll have like a new store or something in this town. Thanks to this quest. There is that quest over here. This is a, uh... Well, hello there. I could use your help, you know, cleaning up the streets. I'm ashamed to admit it, but we've had a rash of jailbreaks, and not enough men on duty to track the criminals down. If you could help us out, I'd pay you for your time. Just find them and drag them back here. No doubt they'll put up a fuss, but you can handle it, I'm sure. That's all. That's great. With your help, we'll get the criminal scum off our streets once and for all. Uh. This is a repeatable quest, so we do it now, and then we'll have to do it again, like every couple of times, if you want to earn some some gold. <gasps> Wait a second. This looks exactly like the guy I just brought into town. They recycle the same guy so that I can arrest him. <laughs> yeah, you basically have to push the left trigger to catch him and that is holding hands who are you to judge me I bet you've pocketed a few unattended items before oh this one's dangerous nice to see him back in jail where he belongs fine job thank you I'll let you know if we need your help again all right So you get a thousand gold every time you capture someone. And there is another side quest over here. Today we're just gonna be helping people before we get to the main quest. Please, you've got to help me, I'm so worried. It's my daughter, you see. I can't find her. That little scamp is always going off on her own, having adventures and whatnot. Always comes back after a while, though, but this time she's been missing for hours and hours. I'm frantic with worry. It's all her father's fault. He never stops talking about how there's gold to be found in the caves in Miss Peak Valley. I bet that's where she's gone. Please find her and bring her home, I beg you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Please bring her back safe and sound as soon as you can. Alright, let's go get that girl. I thought it was the other way, but it's still to go back to this forest. Alright. So this is a fairly easy quest. All you have to do is uh, you go get the girl and you get attacked by I guess wolves I think so it's not really a big deal yeah already we are facing wolves but at least we get some hero points and uh, that's always good there are still some things we need to buy we need to always keep ourselves ahead with the points, because stuff will just uh, eventually get really expensive, and it's going to get really tough to get anything at all. So we're really going to need to watch out for that. Uh, more enemies. Very hostile world. 
I remember that the gnome that is here was easy to find, but the first time I didn't see him. But he was like really easy to find, and I can't recall where exactly he was, but I think he was like underneath this bridge or somewhere at the distance, like in a wall. But I really can't remember where exactly. I mean, it's not like I'm getting them all, but at least if I can show you guys some of them. But, uh, yeah, I just think it's a pain to look for all of them. And I don't think we're going to be getting that much of a big deal out of getting them all anyway. It's not like I know any uh, what you get, but, you know, I just finished this game and uh, I didn't feel the need to look for legendary weapons or anything like that. You know, unlike in Fable, the Lost Chapters, that you have a different set of legendary weapons, the one that you get in the stone, the ultimate uh, weapon, the Sword of Aeons, or Avos Tear, you know, you get some really good choices, and, and there's also a sword behind the one of the demon doors, but, you know, here it's like, I just don't don't see the need to have a legendary weapon because ultimately you do almost the exact same damage with almost any weapon you have and I don't know I just don't see the point in this game I saw the the, tr the new trailer for the uh, for the new fable that is from Kinect and I'm kinda disappointed that it's like Kinect ver uh, version of the game because honestly I mean <laughs> You know, it's not like everybody's into it to have a connect. By the way, it's it's raining right now, so you're gonna be hearing, uh, like maybe some background noise. Yeah, just follow me, girl. See, this time the holding hands thing doesn't look that bad. <laughs> So yeah, I mean the game, the the graphics that they showed on the trailer, uh, make the game look kind of good actually, and they're setting it off in a different direction. You know, it's not like the, it's not like it's a hero now that it's from the bloodline. It's like a different kind of person, like a regular everyday person. So I think that's really cool. You know, to go back to simple beginnings but uh yeah it's kinda sad that that it's only for connect and I'm not really planning on getting a connect myself cause I don't see myself uh, playing like that I'm a really old school uh, controller person <laughs> I mean this is one of the reasons why I didn't get the uh, the Nintendo uh, Wii it's because of the controller and I know that uh, a lot of people like it and all that stuff but you know I'm not the kind of person who enjoy who would enjoy a game but while moving my arms around um, so I don't know when I when I heard about the Wii U that they're going back to like a regular controller uh, you know that's why I got my interest back at that but you know the PlayStation move the uh, the connect I mean I'm just not interested in those things at all oh, it's raining really really hard outside so uh, this recording is not gonna be that good I guess <laughs> or it's probably not gonna be a big deal it's just gonna be some weird background noise I can't control the weather. <laughs> so, let's get this girl back and uh, hopefully that'll be it for this episode. I didn't get to do much, but uh, at least something, something. Getting stuff out of the way. The game's not that short, actually. It's uh, fairly... It's fairly long, I'd say, especially in the end when you have to do a lot of grinding. You have to make a lot of money. And I keep hearing people saying that they all get the bad ending and, and all that, but, you know, 
The first time I played through this game, I got the best ending. And I just figured it out, you know. I didn't look for online guides or anything, I just figured it out. It's really not a big deal. So I hope this uh, Let's Play serves as a... You know, as a guide to get the best out of this game. And perhaps I have a good opinion of it, because... Oh, it's not... <laughs> there's not... Now there's thunder. Wow. That's interesting. I hope the lights don't go out, because that would be bad. Now we have to do this all over again. <sighs> Help me. So, we're almost there. Here's your girl. She's all safe. Yeah, I know, there's, there's your mum. Your mum. Let me mute the mic so that you can hear the conversation. My darling, my little darling, what a relief. I was beside myself. I can't thank you enough. I'm forever in your debt. Yeah, it's a really cool feature to push a button on your mic on your headset and it mutes the the microphone. It's perfect. Oh. Well, I didn't intend to go here, but let's see if uh let's see if there's something I can get. Well, I only got 29. I really don't think so. Yeah, I didn't intend to come here. I was trying to get to the sanctuary. Hmm, blacksmith. You know what? I'm getting this, because in the end I'm going to be using blacksmith to... as part of my strategy from, for getting a lot of money. It's really, really important that you at least choose one of those professions. I chose blacksmith because it's kind of like the easiest and it's the fastest to get the, the gold that you need like really really quickly so you know I highly recommend that you cho choose uh, blacksmith over the other ones because the other ones are you know are kinda slow and uh, I think you gotta choose all of them I'm not entirely sure if you can just skip and get level 4 and that would get level 1 and 2 or something like that. <laughs> but I highly doubt it. I think you gotta get them in order. Never tried that before, but... Or maybe if you get each level, you get more money. So I'm just gonna do it how the game suggests that I do it. I'm not gonna try and cheat my way through. So let's get the heck out of here, and I'll be stopping the recording. Need to get back to the sanctuary. Blue blunder. <laughs> they change wonder for blunder. Yeah, these uh, loading screens. Are these you get to read that stuff. What? But why does someone hate me? I didn't do anything. Oh, this game's glitching on me, man. Stupid game. Yeah, I say. Whoa, that was thunder, actually. Scare the crap out of me. Um. Yeah, I do. I do good to others, and this is what I get. I get someone to hate me. Excellent. Perfect. All right. So I think there's nothing else for me to do around here. So uh, I'll be stopping the recording, and I'll do it as well because I don't know if the lights are gonna go out. So I'll see you guys. Ooh, the wind is blowing inside my room. 
Uh, anyways, see you, see you guys next time. This has been Uzumachi, and I hope I can survive this storm. <laughs> I like to make dramatic exaggerations. Oh, wait, there's a chest here. Let me get this before I end the recording. I knew that I didn't get in here before. There we go. So, see you guys next time. Bye!